Welcome back, Potendo Gamer here, and today we have our final Evolution V Max Premium Collection with the Alternate Arts, and this is Flareon that we're going to be opening up today, and we've opened up Jolteon and also Vaporeon, and uh, hopefully they keep on coming out with products like this because it's awesome. I haven't had the best luck on pulls, so I'm not going to rub Pikachu today, not today, ah, 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 but... We're going to take a look at these anyways. And there is the whole box with the Ultra Art V and VMAX Flareon and the Jumbo Flareon VMAX. And as I've been doing, show on the back so you guys can pause it if you want. But you don't need that. We're going to be opening this up anyways. So, let's go ahead and get right into this. And, well, real quick before I get into that. Got a bunch of code cards I've been giving away. So good luck to you guys. Um, hopefully you guys are subscribed, but if you're not, then uh, make sure you, you subscribe and hit the notification bell on so you can be aware of when I'm uh, dropping these videos again so you can catch some code cards for the online card game that will be soon um, the Pokemon card game on live, or on Pokemon card game live instead of online as I can get that in the frame there for you. And, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys can, uh, like the video too while you're at it. It only takes a second, and it definitely helped me get some, uh, more followers, followers here so I can start, uh, giving away some other things. And this one's not one to open up here. Okay, let's get that coin out of the way. So it's the same in all three of them, but... Go back and check my other videos just to see what I've pulled with those. Didn't get any alternate arts, but hopefully we can change that today. Nice thing is we do have the guaranteed two alternate arts, three if you count the, the jumbos. Um, but these jumbos or these alternate arts are just absolutely gorgeous. Definitely could have used Flareon uh, almost a week ago. Is it, I'm down in Florida, and uh, it was very, very cold for a couple of nights. We had frost warnings, and I ended up um, having some damage to my fruit trees and all sorts of mayhem. Had to cover up all the animals, and it was no bueno. But ooh, just like me dropping the card. But yeah, the centering is pretty good on these, too. I like it. All right. Should go ahead and get that sleeved up. I can grab it. My hands are super dry from all this drier weather. Definitely would could use some rain. All right. And there we go. Okay, so Flareon V alternate art is secure. Let's go ahead and get the V Max out. Yeet. All right. And that is gorgeous. It's a pretty uniform pattern um, on the alternate art V Max. Very cool artwork, though. Got the um, executor laying down there. And is that slow, bro? It almost looks like a one or an eye or something behind it. But yeah, everyone's just kind of. Having a lazy day, looks like. It's, uh, looks like the centering is good on this one too. And on the back, it's a little bit off. It's a little bit too far that way, but I will take it for sure. Tall Shaw. Put that in top loader as well. And hopefully I have to break out more top loaders so that I can put more alternate arts in. That would be amazing. But we have these uh, these two cards, and uh, might as well get this jumbo out. Well, before I do that, in the comments, guys, for the next video, which one would you like me to open up? The Single Strike Urshifu VMAX League Battle Deck or the Rapid Strike Urshifu VMAX League Battle Deck? Um, so just comment Single or Rapid Strike Urshifu. And uh, let me know what you guys, let's not break Pikachu, 
Um, let me know what you guys end up uh, wanting to do there. And uh, get this jumbo card out of here. I'll show you guys, you guys can see the detail of the card. I guess it's not like an eye or a one, just kind of weird shading, I guess, or one of the trees, you can see the, the trunk with the light on it or something. Definitely feel like they could have put more Pokemon in this field, because it's a pretty, pretty massive field. But anyways, still a gorgeous card. And slide this down a little bit more so I can have room. Or I could do this. Let's do that. Let's put you over there. Put you guys over here if I can try not to knock you over. Okay. So let's give you guys some more code cards real quick. While we're kind of in a little natural break of things. And good luck. Good luck, guys. See, I'm not forgetting this time. Last video, I, I forgot to do most of the code cards till the end, which is not how I usually do it. Usually I kind of do things, um, I'm going to keep the code card for the actual um, alternate art cards. Grab the pin out. The pin is similar to the other two, but it's just got a different uh, elemental symbol on the back. So it's got the flames for fire energy and the, the Flareon. It's got like a little bit of a 3D effect on it. Two different um, actual... Um, pins. It's funny on the box it says it has uh, um, functional sharp point objects on here and that's this. It's little things in the back. But anyways, here you go. Here's some more code cards because why not, right? Good luck guys. Good luck. Good luck. Hope I'm not making you guys dizzy. Good luck. And one more and then we can take a look at these packs which I believe are going to be the same as the last one. We've got two Fusion Strike, Vivid Voltage, Evolving Skies, and Chilling Rain, and Rebel Clash. And I'm going to go ahead and do Rebel Clash to kick it off. We're trying to get alternate arts here, so we're going to open up the ones that don't have alternate art options in it. First, this one doesn't even have like a um, Reverse Hollow like, additional card slot basically in there. So, the really Voltage at least has the Amazing Rose you could potentially get. Um, good luck with the code, guys. You could potentially get a, a Amazing Rose in the, or the, in the Reverse Hollow slot, which is one right before the Ultra Rare or Rare slot. And we've got four from the back to the front. We get Psychic Energy, liking it. Metacham, Morgrim, Palpitoad, Shinx. Galarian Mask, Applin, Hatena, Arrokuda, and a Stone Journer. What? This is the second time around. I think I had another pack that didn't have a Reverse Hollow. So they're just not putting Reverse Hollows in these um, Rebel Clash packs for some reason. But at least we started off with a uh, Holographic Rare to kick it off. So at least that's something. Put that up here. And we'll go ahead and go into the Vivid Voltage. Actually, before that, I should do some more code cards because i got so many sitting here. So stay tuned. Good luck, guys. Let me know what you guys get on the uh, code cards when you put them in the online game, too. Or if you're just grabbing some to trade with other people for the cards you really want. Don't be afraid to tell me the truth. Tell me why you're grabbing them. Anyways, hopefully you're not trying to sell them or anything like that online. But anyways, I don't know what, what that came from. It's like shavings of wood or something that was in with the packaging. Fantastic. Hopefully we don't have any wood shavings inside the actual packs. That was a little weird. Okay, so vivid voltage with a chance in the reverse hollow. Hopefully we at least have a reverse hollow um, to get a amazing rare. So hopefully we can have a little bit more luck with that and not get uh, the lack of that card. Okay, so we got Metal Energy, Coating Metal Energy, Shuckle, Delmise, Whalmer, Weedle, Beldum, Fampy, Duskull. We do have the Reverse Hollow, and it's a Reverse Hollow Rare, so that's nice. Whimsicott. 
and a two cannon. So I guess we needed that to kind of save that a little bit. But I will take the reverse hollow rare. All right. So on to Chilling Rain. Yeah. You do Chilling Rain. You know, some of the uh, different YouTubers call it Chilling Pain. Uh, I haven't opened up enough to really give a good gauge of Chilling Rain for me. Uh, I haven't had that much luck with it. But at the same time, I haven't opened very much of it either. So I can't really say how I feel about the set that much because I just haven't opened up enough. So good luck, guys. I'm going to do the card trick. I'm completely forgetting what I'm doing here. One, two, three, four. And we got electric energy, lightning energy. Layer on. Expedition uniform, old cemetery. Ghastly. Coughing. Della Bird. Galarian Farfetch'd, Porygon, Reverse Hollow Snover, and a Frostlass Holographic. So at least we're getting some Holographics and Reverse Hollow Rares. Um, I would like to get an Ultra Rare, though. That would be nice. But I'll take a Frostlass. And let's go to Fusion Strike. You do have the Umbreon artwork there. I'm going to do uh, Genesect first, uh, which is a very, very playable card. I see a lot of people trying to um, trade a bunch of uh, packs for uh, getting the Genesect to utilize that new Fusion Strike, yeah, the Fusion Strike uh, Pokemon. I think it has like a really good ability or something like that. Man, getting, everything's getting stuck to my hands here. Okay. And good luck. We got one, two, three, four. I'm gonna take the check at the and look at the uh, condition of this card. It's got a little bit of whitening, good centering, but we'll see what happens. All right, so we got Metal Energy, Sydney, Cross Switcher, Croconaw with that awesome artwork. Let's see if you can see it a little closer. We got Quillfish, Tynamo. I think that's like actual like a clay picture over actual water. It's interesting how they have like different mediums um, for the artwork, so it's not always drawn. It is some some of them are uh, photos too. So, pan pour, reverse hollow dunsparce, and a toxic croak non holographic. That's a pretty cool card though. All right, ooh yeah, give you guys some more code cards. I'm slacking, slacking on the code cards. Need to make sure I keep up with those a little bit. That way I'm not just bombarding you guys at the end. Okay, Hidden Fates. Fusion Strike with the Mew artwork. Very cool artwork, which I don't know which way it's... Is it up? Is it down? I don't know. All right. And... So we get at least a Ultra Rare. Don't necessarily need to get a alternate art, although I would love one. Any alternate art would do. Um, but Ultra Rare would be nice have it in this as well and pretty good centering just a little bit of uh, whitening on the one corner water energy fusion strike energy turtonator the tautonator puke muke you just sounds like you're saying puke okay it's cool artwork though very interesting psychedelic just like that one's psychedelic too with a smeargle and we got Carvana, Clamperl. Looks like it's almost like singing a melody or something. Kind of looks like a little bit of a like a Kirby. Hmm. More Peko, Skarmory, Bunnelby Reverse Hollow, and an Electros Non Holographic. Okay, so we've got one more chance at glory. We have an Evolving Skies. Let's and before I do that, we've got the Umbre on there. Before I do that, I'm gonna do some more code cards, cause why not? So good luck, guys. Good luck. Hopefully you guys are having better pulls than I am. <laughs> it doesn't take much. All right, do one of these two. We got Shining Legends. Okay. So Umbreon, don't do us wrong. Come on, bro. We need a little help on this opening. My buddy, buddy uh, Jay Ziggy. 
commented that this was going to be a fire opening on this one. He just he felt it in his bones, but we haven't seen it yet. Kind of peeped something. So I think we at least we have a hit, I think, here. Unless I'm just crazy and seeing things. So I, I, I've been known to see uh, cards that aren't there. We'll see what we got here. So we've got a fighting energy and as well as Zinnia's Resolve. We're getting some uh, dragon stuff. Maybe we get a, uh, gosh, I can't even think right now. Where is he? Not even there. He's over here. Oh, don't know. Oh, that's that's bad. That's bad. We just knocked everything over. Trying to uh, see the Pokemon and visualize it. I'm not... I can't even think of the name of this Pokemon here. I don't deserve it if I get it. <laughs> I'm just drawing a blank. It's not even that late. Usually I do this at like 2 o'clock in the morning. It's like 11 right now. So I have no excuses. Um... Rayquaza, Rayquaza, Rayquaza. Okay, I remember it. Mareep. Maybe there's a Rayqu Rayquaza alternate art in here. How awesome would that be? Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet's in a lot of pain. Get a Reverse Hollow. Fletchlander. Ooh, don't fall. Don't fall. Don't fall. We gotta have you upright for this, because this might be something really important. Might be something really cool. We do have all Umbreon VMAX. That's a heck of a pull. I will take that. We have the Umbreon VMAX in the Umbreon... Where's the... Where'd it go? In the Umbreon pack. I will definitely take that. That's pretty awesome. It's really good centering, too. Really, really good centering. Okay. And the centering's pretty decent there. It's a little bit that way, but... And just a little bit high. But I will definitely take that. Definitely will take that. That made the opening... Umbreon literally came in with himself. <laughs> Umbreon came in with the Umbreon. All right, got another thing to put in the top loader. Sweet. I wasn't sure if uh, I was going to get to use those things outside of the uh, guaranteed pulls here, but all right. So we got Umbreon to go along with our Flareon and our other Flareon. So now we've got... Actually, I should put him over there because it's a little bit... Actually, it's hard to see both of them that way. There we go. So, those are our hits, guys. Two guaranteed hits from this uh, collection box. And the Umbreon VMAX at the end to save the day. Um, be sure to tell, check out my other uh, alternate art boxes, the premium collections for the other uh, evolutions. And don't forget to comment whether you want to see Rapid Strike or Single Strike or Shifu League Battle decks opened and kind of like looked over and see what, what kind of cards are in here. Um, I definitely want to use these in the online card game. Um, speaking of online card game, here's some more code cards, guys. Some Shining Legends and Champion's Path. And more Champion's Path. And here's XY Evolutions. And Vivid Voltage. Hidden Fates. Charizard GX, Hidden Fakes, Hidden Fakes, <laughs> Hidden Fates, Gyarados GX, and oh my gosh, I finally did it, finally did it, I've, I've almost knocked over my camera a million times, and I finally did not catch it, uh, Hidden Fates, Raichu GX, if you guys are still with me, sorry if anybody had their earphone, or their uh, earpods in, and had a loud noise or anything, but... I made a mistake. Get a little excited and I'm flailing around here and knocking my own my phone, which is my camera, over. We're getting close to the end of these. We got a few more here. So alright. Sorry for my poor camera skills, but there we are. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And until next time, when I open up one of these, one of these League Battle decks, let me know which one. Peace.